What does this day mean for you and, and student athletes like yourself? Um, it just means that our potential as far as how we develop ourselves as people, not only just as athletes, is limitless. Um, it, this has opened so many opportunities for, for myself and my fellow student athletes. And I think what's awesome about this is that it really doesn't matter if you play a revenue generating sport or if you're just a, a tennis player that maybe not everyone would recognize you if you go out in public. There is an audience for you and this bill will allow you to cater to it and make a profit off of it in the process. Right. And how do you see that benefiting women's sports especially? Um, if I'm not mistaken, uh, women basketball players in particular, uh, with their social media presence, have the most uh, money to make in this process. Um, I, I don't remember the numbers, but I have seen a graphic floating around where like, uh, you have women's basketball players on UConn in South Carolina with tons of followers. Like, players like them can, can really you know, have the chance to work with a big company and make some good money. Or there's players like that may not even play Division One basketball, but play Division Two, Division Three. They still have an audience that cares about what they're doing, that cares about what they think. And now with the NIL being passed, they have an opportunity to um, make some money off of it. Sure. And what does your platform look like as far as your reach, maybe your social media following? I mean, what, what does that look like for you? Sure. So as a uh, type 1 diabetic athlete, um, that's kind of like my little niche. That's my community that I care about. Um, so I would love to have the opportunity to work with, um, like, for example, the company that makes my insulin pump or the company that makes my glucose monitor that allows me to know what my blood sugar is during practice without having to literally stop practice and go check what it is. Like things like that that allow... Uh, a diabetic like me to play collegiate sports, I, I would love to work with those types of brands and show everyone else like, hey, I'm a diabetic, I'm an athlete, this is how I do what I do, stuff like that. For sure. And how do you see this, I mean, do you see this following you past, you know, college? I mean, now that you have this platform and maybe you go on to play professionally or whatever you want in your career, I mean, do you see this benefiting you in, in the long run? I think it definitely will benefit me in the long run. Um, one way that I, I know it will is that um, the University of Illinois Athletic Department has shown that they're dedicated to helping us through this process. They're going to help educate us and make sure that we're doing things the right way and they're going to have our backs. Um, and we're going to learn so many things. Like the people that are really business savvy are probably going to have an edge over, over some of us. Um, but just being here at, at this school where they're dedicated to using their resources to helping us make money off our name, that's just incredible. Have you heard from anyone yet? I mean, either locally, nationally? I mean, what does this process look like for you so far? Um, I haven't heard from anyone yet. Um, I did uh, tag the company that makes my insulin pump in an Instagram post, and they did follow me. So um, I'm hoping that Good. perhaps something will come of that, uh, but we'll see. Yeah, what's the company? Um, the it's called Omnipod. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Anything else you want to add? Um, I'm, I'm just really excited about this opportunity and I, I really can't wait for uh, in the coming years to see how the bill develops and how federally we, we will see more uh, more changes and more opportunities for us. Cool. And how are you just looking forward to the season ahead? It'll be your final season? It, actually, um, I will, I'm a fifth year uh, senior right now, so okay. I'll play this season, but then I will have an additional year because of COVID, so yeah. I'll be around for a little while. Okay. Um, but I, I'm just so, so excited. Like, even just coming to practice and, and having COVID, like, being almost over, and we can just come to the gym whenever we want and not have to worry about masks and testing every day, it's just kind of brought us a lot of joy back into playing our sport, so it's been awesome.